And the article was written in 2018 by a woman stating that women needed to act now and fast, stating that if not, male-designed robots would take over women's lives, replace them, jobs would be lost, or worse, people would stop populating. Going in that direction, male-designed robots, female robots with giant boobs and the perfect bodies. Although fun, these robots surely could not give birth. Anyway, before we go on any further and dig deeper into the concerns that some women have towards the future of artificial intelligence in humanoid robots, as a man, can I say, why do women feel as if or fear that artificial intelligence in female robots will replace them? Couldn't they just be an addition to the relationship, the family, or the household? A love doll or a human companion doll with an artificial intelligent brain is a realistic humanoid robot capable of displaying human-like expressions and interacting with people. It's designed for research, education, and entertainment and can help promote public discussion about artificial intelligent ethics and the future of robotics. Robotic assistants, in most cases, we're talking about the wheeled varieties, already help care for the elderly, care by providing remote access to medical assistance, while medical staff can use them to help clean and carry out very basic tasks, freeing them to tackle more demanding work. Robots can ensure better accuracy within the workplace, which reduces the likelihood of human error. When robots work alongside humans, they can help reduce mistakes by carrying out critical tasks without humans having to risk their lives. So surely, a human-like female robot would be a welcomed addition to any relationship, family, or household, right? Well, an article written by a woman in 2018 put the idea out there that algorithms in artificial intelligence were starting to show more and more male bias. Whether it was or is true or not, women would have a lot to lose unless they got involved. Further, the article continued down this road, mostly straying away but looping around algorithms and artificial intelligence. But maybe it's just that. Men look forward to a future with artificial intelligence in a human-like female companion, a robot, while women want to take that away, all while probably hiding a pocket-sized battery-operated companion of their own somewhere underneath their bed. LOL. I don't know. Anyway, brain time. Congratulations. You made it this far in the video. What would you do if I told you you could have 25 years of good luck and all you'd have to do is like this video and also subscribe if you haven't already? Well, what are you waiting for? Smash that like button and you'll get 25 years of good luck. And now, back to the video. Enthusiasts and scientists say that robots can improve our quality of life and make the world a better place, not by replacing humans, but by working effectively together. Nowadays, there is no debate that robots are more efficient at manufacturing goods than humans. So does the appearance of a robot or a humanoid robot matter? Would the color of the robot's skin or metallic texture or lifelike texture or lifelike skin make our future robots better? Or is it just what it is? A few weeks ago, I made a video talking about the price and what future AI in robotics would cost. A quick Google shopping search will bring up a variety of different humanoid robots that you can purchase for as low as 30 US dollars. But then, probably not the humanoid robot that you envision. Because when we think about humanoid robots, we think of human-like robots with giant bosoms and the perfect bodies. At least that's what I envision. But maybe I've been watching too many YouTube videos. 
a quick Google search, a thousand dollars, and a credit card, and you can get a love doll sent to your house in a matter of days. See what I did there? Not use the S word, but rather called them love dolls? Trying to keep the video clean. But that's really all it is. Because for less than a thousand dollars, sure you could find yourself a lifelike blow up doll that feels truly realistic, but it's gonna be missing the AI and the brain. And that's what we're pushing for the future to be all about. Anyway, that's pretty much all I got. If you like this video and you wanna watch more videos like it, make sure you check out all my other videos. And if you haven't already, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe, till next time, catch you in the next one.